If you like this video or content, please give me a subscribe. If you like the actual video, give me a thumbs up. But anyway, let's continue on with the video. Hello, welcome to the Retro Show. I'm Mike, and we're gonna be looking at new games for your VIC-20. If you're stumbling upon my channel and wondering what's going on, I mostly play homebrew games, hacks, and game modifications for retro systems. But anyway, you're more interested in uh, new games for your Commodore VIC-20, so stay tuned. Hello, welcome back. So, um, well, first game I want to show you is, so, okay, so um, somebody in the Sleeping Elephants form, that's pretty much everything you need to know from uh, Vic-20 standpoint, <laughs> all the, the stuff that's going on, like with them talking about how great the game, the system is, and it is a great system. Uh, one of the guys wanted to play a Oregon Trail couldn't find it, so he just ported the open source version from 1975, like the basic version. And here it is. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> I love this kind of stories. So, yeah, it's from the Minnesota, Minnesota, uh, Minnesota Educational Computing Consortium, 1975. So, this is the original. No graphics, nothing, just typing. Uh, yes. Family of five will cover. There's no graphics whatsoever, like in the later versions, like in the DOS versions. You just spend the rest of your money. All right. You have like seven hundred dollars. Good luck. How much you want to spend on oxen? Let's spend two fifty. Food, one hundred. So that's three fifty. Ammunition. 50 bucks. Clothing, 100 bucks. 50 bucks. We have $150 left. Uh, I'm going to say C O N T. I'm going to eat poorly. Did it crash? Oh, helpful Indian show where you find more food. Thank you. What do I do? I want to hunt. Hunting. Uh, moderately. Uh, I'm going to say run, uh, I'm going to say, I'm going to continue. Oh, uh oh, stop. I'm going to stop at the next fort. Uh, $30, $1. One dollar, one dollar. I'm gonna eat two. I'm gonna attack. B A N G. Lousy shot, you got knife. You have the see old doc. Okay. Breaks, lose, uh, fixing it. Wow. Twenty dollars. I got shot, doc. I'm going to hit moderately. Uh-oh. I'm going to continue. Poorly. Wild animals attack. Type in bang. Oh my god, I suck. Hunt. I have no more food left. Bang. Uh, yes. Yes. No. 
Too bad. <laughs> That's funny. All right, all right. So uh, I'm going to swap the machine. I'm going to put no, because there's a couple of games that don't need um, expanded memory. I think it's this one. Let's try this one. Ooh, sound. Uh, my bladder control? You hurry and find the toilet before the meter runs out and you lose control of was. Right, A, W, S, D to move. Oh, okay. Press the key to start. All right. The after party. Filling bladder. Uh, okay. Who? Oh, there goes my bladder. Ah. Reminds me of the, um, the DOS game I played that, oh, there's a, ah, 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 the, the, the one I got to pee, you got to run around peeing, and you pee in plants, you pee in toilets, you pee in everything. What a weird game. <laughs> Where's the toilet? I need it. I need to go potty. I hope that was not there. Not good. Okay. Drip, drip. <laughs> all right, all right. The next game. This is called Turtle, Turbo Turtle. Press fire to start. Can I? Oh. Oh. So cute. Uh. Oh. Ah, uh, come on, come on. There. I got two turtles. I got the two turtles. I got the turtles. Why? Why? Oh. Am I boned? Or is that just... 
Oh, okay. Go, 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 go. Oh. He zapped one of the turtles. Oh. Whoa. Uh. Am I boned? Oh, there you go. I turned on the light. Oop. Uh. What the? I guess I can only go this way. Um, oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Alright, ooh, ooh. Extra life. Get another turtle. Got another turtle. Nope, nope, yeah, yes. I got another turtle. Got another turtle. Gotta get away from the door. Ooh. Oh, you little monkeys. Turn on the light. Poor little turtles. No. Oh, you. He just zaps them. Get out of the way. I'm sorry, little turtle. <laughs> All right. Fine. So, next game. Last game. This is the keep. This doesn't use any expanded memory. Uh, I'm going to say random. Hello? Hello? Oh, whoa. Oh. Whoa. Um, okay. -hoo -hoo. Wow, this is cool. Whoa. Um. Okay. Oh, I got the key. How do I turn? I know I turn so oh. Um This is that up and down. Yeah, but how do I like like turn turn? Do I move the can I move the controller? Oh, oh, okay. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, this is so trippy. Oh, wow. Like to, to do this on a, with no memory expansion on a VIC-20, that is awesome. Oh, um. I don't even know what I'm supposed to do. I'm just flabbergasted at how well this is done. Uh, oh, crashed. <laughs> That's too bad. Oh, no, it didn't. Oh, I went to the next level. Oh, this is so neat. Oh. Oh, that's my footsteps. I was wondering what that noise was. No, I can't do that because I don't have a key. This would have blown my mind back in the day. Uh. 
Whoa. Oh, oh, there we go. There's a key. There's a key. All right, I'm going to turn around. There. Oh, that's another key. Oh. Like for the expanded memory, you could probably make a neat little RPG in here. Yeah, that was a key. Those are doors. I'm not going to make it. What? Oh. Hmm. One more door over there. I don't know if I can make it though. Um, there. Oh, there we go. I made it. Bet you a lot of you were like, so what? But a lot of people who know the limitations of the VIC-20 were going, oh my god, this is, looks so cool. Considering the limitations of how very little memory. This is on an unexpanded VIC-20. I'm not going to explain why, but trust me, if you're a veteran of the VIC-20, this... I can't stress enough how amazing this is. I don't know um, that somebody can do this kind of graphics on this little system from 1982. And we have some talented, talented people. And as always said about the limitations will breed creativity. I forget why, I think I heard that the other day, but it's so true. You have unlimited uh, hard drive space and unlimited p processing power, but you give somebody limited uh, stuff, they decide you know, to, to code with those limitations. There you go. Anyway, I will not bore you more. You have to check it out below. If you have a stock VIC-20 with a tape drive, you want to download this, be my guest. Uh, I do have a VIC-20. Again, I have to clean it. I know I keep saying that. But anyway, if you like these kind of videos, give me a thumbs up. If you don't like them, give me a thumbs down. Any feedback will be appreciative. And if you like this kind of content, maybe consider subscribing. Until the next video, this is Mike signing off.